I'm Kim from 19 Grams, and today I'm going to give you some helpful hints on how to make an espresso on an espresso machine. So there's a few elements that we need to cover. The first one we're going to talk about is the dose, which I have right here. So uh, the dose is 19 grams for us, and it's always based on your basket size. Uh, it's really important to have the right amount of coffee in the basket, because if you have too less, then you're going to get a really bitter tasting shot, and if you have too much, it's going to be under extracted and really sour. The second thing is the tamp. The tamp needs to be really flat, and you want to have enough pressure on it that you're leaning on the bench, and then polish. Then we're going to talk about the grind size. So usually grinders are always the same. You have numbers on the top, ours is 0 to 10, and the smaller the number, the smaller the grind size, and the slower the coffee is going to run through the portafilter. If you find your coffee running too slowly, then you need to make the numbers, the larger numbers, more visible on the grinder so it runs a bit quicker. Then we're going to talk about the yield. The way we roast our coffee is always two times the dose. So if I'm using a 19 grams dose, my yield's going to be 38. And what you really want to see when you're making an espresso is that the coffee coming through the portafilter at the same time in a nice smooth line. And this looks really good. If you have a too short a yield, the coffee is going to be quite concentrated because there's not enough water in it and it's going to be really, really strong. And if you have too large a yield, there's too much water through the coffee part and it's going to be quite weak. So you want to find a nice balance where it's the perfect strength. And this looks really good. Look at that crema. Liquid gold in a cup. Smells good. And it tastes really good too.